Okay, so we are here in the Ragged Flagon. Looking to uh, join up with the uh, Thieves Guild. Give it up, Brynjolf. Those days are over. Ah, oh, there's Brynjolf. This one is different. Hmm. Who We've are you? We've heard that one before, Bryn. Quit kidding yourself. It's time to face the truth. If you're looking for conversation, Thanks. the Flagon isn't the place. That's nice. Dying breed. Things are changing. Dying breed, eh? Well, what do you call that, then? Well, well. Color me impressed, lass. I wasn't certain I'd ever see you again. What do you mean? Uh, getting here was easy. Reliable and headstrong? You're turning out to be quite the prize. So, now that I've whetted your appetite with our little scheme at the market, how about handling a few deadbeats for me? Sure. Uh, what'd they do? They owe our organization some serious coin, and they've decided not to pay. I want you to explain to them the error of their ways. Uh, sounds good. Uh, who are they? Kirava, Percy Honeyhand, and Helga. Do this right, and I can promise you a permanent place in our organization. Uh, how do you want me to handle it? Honestly, the debt is secondary here. What's more important is that you get the message across that we aren't to be ignored. A word of warning, though. I don't want any of them killed. Bad for business. I consider it done. Good. If you need any details on your marks, I'll be here. Now get going. Uh, any tips about Kariva? Kirava is stuck but she's got a soft spot for family. Talk to Talon J at the B and Barb, and see if yep. you can get she something out of it. They're well acquainted, if you catch my meaning. Ah. Uh, how about uh, Bercy? He's as pig-headed a man as you'll ever find. The key is that ugly dwarven urn in his shop. Smash that thing to bits and he'll hey. change his attitude. Okay. How about uh, Helga? Helga is a devout follower of Debella dotes over the statue to the divine that she keeps at the bunkhouse. Use it as leverage, and she'll cave. Alrighty. I'll be here when you're done. Not a problem. You better think to pay for your drinks. There's no handouts here. Hey, Todd, you shouldn't cheat on Beckle. He's a good guy. What are you talking about? Come on. Everyone knows about you and Brynjolf. Well, everyone's wrong. Now why don't you just shut up about it? Let's check the uh, mission out here and see. Collect the debt, debt, debt. Optional. Smash the urn. Okay. Where they are. Uh, show. Okay. We'll just do it this way. Oh, good. They're all in Riften. That makes it easy. See you there, Mr. Rat. Come here. Burn. Take it. Apple 
apples. Poor apples. Wow. Excuse me. Coming through. Riften. Don't need to torch out here. Ooh, butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. Meh. Okay. Looking to stay alive? Why take a chance? Sorry, lady. This part you've already seen, hopefully, and just gonna cut this part out. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. Welcome to Riften, home of the Thieves Guild. Or so they'd have you believe. It's all lies. Vermin creeping around the rat hole. Okay, so got an ego now, and gave him the uh, the Contractor Mavari, I believe armor it is, and uh, face mask and hood. That dude's wearing a uh, ball on his head. Come on, Nigo, let's go. So, can I interest you in anything today? Uh, what do you have for sale? Take a look. Take all that. I can take that. You can take that. Okay. Anyway, I have a message uh, from Brynjolf. What? Oh, it's one of you people. So Brynjolf doesn't even bother to show up himself anymore, eh? What's this message? 
Uh, simple. You don't pay, bad things are gonna happen. Petty threats and fist-waving are not going to sway me. You people are all talk. And everyone knows it. You demand payment for protection. And you can't even protect yourselves! Uh, we can protect ourselves. Trust me. Don't fool yourself. It's only a matter <clears throat> of time before you people are run out of Riften. I've had enough of this. Likewise. Now I have a lot to do. So I'm afraid you'll just have to leave. I'm not going anywhere. Oh, what's this? Must we arm ourselves I here? Pay, I do not want to frighten the locals. This isn't happening. Please, I don't have anything to pay you with. Don't destroy my urn! Oh my word. Please. I don't have anything to pay you with. Hey, watch it! Turn. Just pay you see. No! Going to break it. That's the oh whole point. Please, I don't have anything to pay you with. Don't destroy my urn! Oh my uh -oh. word. Uh how about you pay no. up? That urn was priceless. Well, you should have, uh, paid up. You want to pay me? You want me to break anything else? All right. How about your face? It. I'll pay on time from now on. <clears throat> Just don't smash anything else. Here, take your gold and leave me in peace. They keep giving and giving, Bercy, and they'll keep taking and taking. When is it going to end? What would you have me do, woman? Cross the guild? Take them all on, one by one? You know I don't mean that. We need to find a way out of this. Perhaps talk to Layla. Layla is as clueless as she's stupid. No. If anything's to be done about this, we have to deal with it ourselves. <clears throat> Mr. Dragonfly would like to take a moment to remind you that he is invaluable and irreplaceable. Yeah, he is. I want to smash his jar. Any thoughts? I'm thinking you should sell off anything we do not need. I just did. Anyway, do let's go. Get ripped off. Next, uh, get to the next mark. A couple apples will take care of that real quick. Who's next? <clears throat> ah, the uh, statue. The door open. That's not going to work. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Well, where is that? Aunt Helga, why demean yourself with these people you barely know? They show no real love for you. It's only a bit of fun. You're a lovely young thing. You should try it sometime. No, I'm saving myself for someone special. Someone who loves me dearly. You mean Sibby? You must be joking. All he wants to do is bed you and be done with it. You may as well get it over with and let him. You're wrong. Sibby and I are in love. And you're just jealous. Naluva, you promised me you'd pay me back yesterday. So right, where the is this statue? Just give me a few more days, and I promise I'll come up with it. If you'd stop wasting your coin on that skooma, you'd have enough gold to live on. Skooma. Sorry, Typhus. I'll get it to you somehow. Oh, 
it's not upstairs. Great dam in front of me. That's a... Uh, Please, don't take the statue. It's the only thing of value I have left. So, uh, should I stop the, uh, drop the statue down a well? Not Lady DiBella. No, please, I can't lose her. I get the message. Here, take your gold. I hope you choke on it. Ah, damn. I feel that. Yeah. Should have gotten her money first and then stolen the statue. <clears throat> All right, who is next? Let me give you some room. Oh, thank you. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you paid. Want. I think you know what I want. Uh, you might want to uh, talk some sense into uh, Kariva. With the rumors going around about how poorly your guild's been doing, she's become much too bold. I'm not that foolish. The last thing I want is a war with your people. Then you help me convince her to pay? Look, I'm only telling you this because I care for her. Don't mistake this as acceptance for what you do. Kiraba has some family at a farm just inside of Morrowind. If you mention you know about it, she might just listen to you. Just please don't harm anyone. I couldn't bear the thought. Yet. The Dress family doesn't steal in Darren. For your sake, I hope you're right. If you'll excuse me, I have other things to attend to. finds out. That's the Dreth family is going to be one member smaller. Let's you look like you could use a drink. Here for a room or something to drink? Uh, Show something me some to coins. drink, actually. Uh, what do you have for sale? Take a look. <clears throat> yeah, a jug of milk would do. And see us again. Yeah, what do you want? If this is about the metery, we can talk later. <clears throat> oh, that was weird. Looking to stay alive? Why take I'm a chance? Selling oh. fine jewelry here. Let me guess, she was in here already. What do you want? Well, that's want just a fail. I have a message for you from, uh... Grinyov. Look, everything was all just a misunderstanding. I didn't mean to tell Brynjolf to go jump off the pier. You tell him I'm sorry, yes? Take this. Every single coin I owe is there. I swear it. Okay. That takes care of that. Alrighty. Where did... And I'm hungry. Oh, there you are. No matter the weather, Riften always smells lovely. It is a good place to start a new adventure. Uh, mind if I ask you something? I am all ears. Tell me about your past. My brother and I never knew our real parents. 
We were found abandoned in a smelly shack by a soldier on his way to battle. We melted his heart with our fuzzy little faces, and he carried us to the nearest town. <clears throat> he deposited us at an orphanage, and that is where we spent most of our childhood. If you need anything else, just ask. Okay, come on. <clears throat> Back to uh, the right way. There's an apothecary down there. It's down on the lower walkway, so stay sharp if you go down there. I run the meat and produce stand at the mark. Come by and see if you want some of the freshest food you've ever eaten. Random water cutter tax. That'll come in handy. That guy doesn't look too happy to be down here right now. Uh, dude, the fire is over that way. Off. So, job's done and you even brought the gold. Best of all, you did it clean. I like that. Dumping bodies and keeping the guards quiet can be expensive. Uh, here's what they owed us. Well done. And it would seem I owe you something in return. Here Such you as. go. I think you'll find these quite useful. Hmm, nice. Uh, what's next then? Judging from how well you've handled those shopkeepers, I'd say you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Uh, yeah. If there's more gold where that came from, I'm in. That's the spirit. Larceny's in your blood. The telltale sign of a practice thief. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. Uh, before I, uh, we go, I have to ask. What's on your mind? Where it is your outfit isn't doing well, true? We've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making us coin, and I'll worry about everything else. Is that enough? Uh, fair enough. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me and I'll show you what we're all about? Secret passage. This is the one I was talking about. Our new recruit. This better not be another waste of the guild's resources, Grignol. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. 
You break the rules and you lose your share. No debates, no discussions. You do what we say, when we say. Do I make myself clear? Uh, I understand, but how can I trust you with a name like Fry? Good, then I think it's time we put your expertise to the test. Wait a minute. You're not talking about Golden Glow, are you? Even our little Vex couldn't get in. You claim this recruit possesses an aptitude for our line of work. So let her prove it. Golden Glow Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Grignol will provide you with the details. Mercer, aren't you forgetting something? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Since Grignol assures me you'll be nothing but a benefit to us when you're in. Welcome to the Thieves Guild. Welcome to the family, lass. I'm expecting you to make us a lot of coin. So don't disappoint me. I won't. Uh, how do I get my uh, cut of the spoils? Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. We can't turn a profit by killing. You should talk with Delvin, Mallory, and Vex. They know their way around this place, and they'll be able to kick some extra jobs your way. Oh, and talk to Tanelia in the flagon. She'll set you up with your new armor. Uh, tell me about uh, the Golden Glow job. Golden Glow Estate is a new farm. They raise the wretched little things for honey. It's owned by some smart mouth wood elf named Aragog. We need you to teach him a lesson by burning down three of the estate's hides and clearing out the safe in the main house. What's the catch? The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Mercer mentioned would be furious if you did. That makes sense. Hi. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. Uh, what should I do about uh, Arangoth? Maven prefers that Arangoth remains alive. But if he tries to stop you from getting the job done, kill him. The guild has a lot riding on this. Don't make me look foolish by mucking it up. I need a little bit more uh, details about Golden, Golden, Golden Glow. Golden Glow Estate brought in a mountain of gold for the guild. You could almost call it our sweetest deal. Then out of the clear blue, Arangoth stopped sending us our cut. Mercer was, well, angry to put it kindly. So we send in Vex and find out he's hired a bunch of mercenaries to guard the place. Mercenaries? Not, uh, not the Riften guards? Aye. Arangoth sent the city guard packing and fortified the entire island. In fact, Vex barely made it out of there alive. Damn. You should talk to her about it before you go. Uh, how do I destroy the uh, beehives? They're built like small fortresses to resist the weather, but their one weakness is flame. Besides, nothing tells the people of Riften we mean business better than a huge column of smoke. Why not look? That's a dumb question. I'll give you one good reason. Maven Blackbriar. Burn all the hives, and she'd have to import honey for Blackbriar Meadery, which would cut into her profits. Uh, Maven is the uh, influential client? We had an arrangement with Maven. We kept an eye on Golden Glow Estate to make sure the honey kept flowing. If the workers had a dispute, we'd rough them up. If competitors tried to buy honey from Arangoth, We'd steal the shipments. In return, Maven allowed us to extort Arangoth and bring in a huge payout. Uh, so how dangerous is it to cross Let her? Let me put it to you this way. Nothing happens in Riften without Maven's consent. One word from her, and you could spend the rest of the fourth era in prison. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. You want to talk? Uh, sure, any thoughts? Are you sure it is okay that I am here? Well, that's why you have the face mask and the, uh, the hood. Let us go. Yes, let's. 
Okay, and we're going to end it there. Next time, uh, when Bad Alyssus returns, we're going to continue on with the Thieves Guild. Thanks for watching.